Hello, I'm Emma Herway. A new provider in Bedford is offering same-day and next-day appointments. The primary care need is um, lacking here in Bedford, especially for the underserved. The Indiana Health Center is one of two health offices in Lawrence County. The center provides basic care, physicals, vaccinations, and a lab on site. Approximately 6,000 patients were displaced after Ascension St. Vincent's Dunn Hospital closed abruptly last year. The center can see patients so quickly because it is still building its patient load. IHC accepts most insurance plans, including private ones. The Monroe County Community School Corporation is hosting two community meetings to hear from parents about the proposed merger of Childs and Templeton Elementary Schools. The merger is one potential solution to balancing socioeconomic disparities in the district, but some parents are concerned that it's not an effective solution. The meetings will take place Wednesday at Jackson Creek Middle School and Thursday at Templeton Elementary. Severe storms are possible tonight and into Wednesday. Forecasters at the National Weather Service in Indianapolis say large hail, damaging winds, and tornadoes are possible. Time frame of storms is most likely between 9 p.m. and 4 a.m. An approaching cold front could drop temps to 34 degrees tonight. A wind advisory remains in place until 4 p.m. Wednesday for wind gusts up to 40 miles per hour. Now here's a quick look at that weather forecast. Tonight, there is an 80% ch chance of showers with a low of 34 degrees. And looking ahead to the five-day forecast, tomorrow we still have a chance of showers, 30% chance with a high of 69. And it will cool off into the rest of the week with a high of 46 on Thursday. For more local news, go to WTIUnews.org and catch Indiana News Desk Fridays at 6.